Historic Figures Who was Abigail Adams? Learning Intention Compare good citizens in the past to good citizens today. Success Criteria Identify examples of how Abigail Adams was a good citizen. Materials needed. Your laptop and a bio on Abigail Adams. She was the wife of second U.S. President John Adams and mother to John Quincy Adams, sixth U.S. President. Abigail was born in a time when most thought women were not intelligent enough to learn. Women were not allowed to attend school, own property, or vote. But Abigail's mother taught her reading, writing, and arithmetic. Abigail's father had a large library, and Abigail read as many books as she could to educate herself in various academic subjects. Abigail Adams married John Adams, a country lawyer, on October 25, 1764. Five of their six children lived to adulthood. In 1776, John Adams was a member of the Continental Congress and is considered one of the founding fathers of the United States. His duties took him away from home often, and because of this, he and Abigail exchanged many letters. Abigail was an intelligent and talented writer. More than 1,100 letters between them still exist. As the new nation was being formed, Abigail urged her husband to consider the rights of women, that women should be considered equals with men, that they are entitled to vote, seek education, own property, make their opinions known, and be more than just silent partners to their husbands. As she once wrote to her husband, remember the ladies. Abigail Adams was a woman who firsthand witnessed the fight for American independence. She also recognized the contribution women could make to society and pleaded this cause openly. Abigail Adams died on October 28, 1818, at the age of 73. Now that you saw that wonderful video, now read or listen to the biography of Abigail Adams. You may click on the one that says read or listen to the article below about Abigail Adams. Class Discussion Name two characteristics of a good citizen that describes Abigail Adams from the biography you read or listened to. Abigail, Abigail Adams was characteristic because to why. Reply to at least one person's comment to the discussion as well.